<laughs> Hi guys, I saw last video that the flip was flipped this way. Um, so this time we're gonna do it properly. <laughs> well, sorry about that trouble, guys. It won't happen again. So, anyways, uh, we have today Tamiya's miniature weapon set. We have the U.S. weapon set, and we have the German weapon set. So, today I'm reviewing both weapon sets. Let's start with our Tamiya mini military miniatures. Okay, so that's why I saw a bit rowdy. Uh, I sound a bit tired because I woke up in the morning and the delivery came for the Humvee, so now I'm fully awake. So this kit comes with flamethrower, a one a one carbine, M1 Grand, Spring Fields and Moids and stuff like that. On the side we have an M2 Brown machine gun, bazooka, motor. Another is that another motor? I have no idea what that is. Recoil this round. Oh, so I think we're gonna start. It's only fair to start with the uh, Germans' weapon set. The American, sorry, weapon set. Okay, sorry. This is the uh, M Grand. Showed you M Grand VAR. Breach gun, the M carbine. So let's open up the box. See what we get. In the box, we get. Bag of screws. Instruction manual and bunch of paper. This shows you I think how to assemble your uh, stuff. So if you like you can put bayonets, mount bayonets on your M1 grand rifle and a scope. Flowing for and how to build the M2 Brown, right? Let's take a look at the kits here. So this time we're gonna actually take them out of the bag so we can check out what we have. Right, so we have, okay, if I can get it out of the bag. What we have is, okay, three, two, one, two sprues. <laughs> Oh, and this, these two ropes you see are for the uh, flamethrower. I am happy that they came with two because we have two flamethrower sets. You see what I mean? These two sprues are the exact same. That's why they are two pipes. Let's get a close up of the uh, M1 carbines here. We have M1 carbine and we have an M1A1 carbine and another M1A1 carbine. Two M1s. M1 grand, M1 grand. BAR, I have to admit, BAR is a pretty nice looking bipod. Here's on the other side. We have our uh, HMG, aka the um, M2 Browning. This is my favorite machine gun out of all. M1A1 Thompson, flamethrower bit, and we have ammo belts. Let's take a look at those. Those are neatly molded. So here's our Thompsons, how they look. They look very good, including our flamethrower. M1919 looks very beautiful. Here we have an M1 Grand with a grenade launcher, grease gun, ammo pouches, flamethrower. Um, we have our bipod stuff. Here's a much more close up of the M1 carbines and Grand's. Take a look at the detail on the other side. See how detailed that they did it. They did a very good job. Wow. Super detailed. 
and the, the screw is exactly the same so you get just the same stuff and here's the rope if I can get it to focus right that was the American's weapon set now we'll do I might do a video of how to paint weapons uh, show you how you can do realistic things. Um, uh, I'm gonna soon I I have done not done a video of this but soon enough I'll do a video of this tank uh, but more of this tank later on right after the video I'll talk about the tank because I'm gonna do a review video of it okay so again that was the US military weapon set and uh yeah it's quite a good kit and here we have our us i do have to put this away us military weapon set model kit made by Tanya. and you don't have to do exactly to me yeah there are other weapon sets you can buy soviet weapons set by Minya. i just prefer me here because they don't come with like metal parts right here we have a germans weapon set military miniatures we have anti-tank gun we have car 98 k's which are one of my favorite world war ii rifles even mp40 stungewehr stg44 beautiful mg42 mg43 we have uh, mg44 two mg44 Probably four of them. Uh, German stick grenade, multi, multi head stick grenade charge. Okay. Grenade carrying handle case. I think you're supposed to carry grenades in there and other stuff. Ammunition boxes, I mean, ammunition. Lunga POAs and stuff like that. Let's take a look a close up, a close up of the military miniatures weapon set <laughs> yeah sorry I put up like that like that anyways okay that out okay. here we are let's take a look at the instructions blah 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 has all those on tells the history of the guns when they were made and stuff nice instructions okay Let's take a look before we take a look better to just put the papers away now now never put the papers away now you can look at this open the bag okay uh, by the way these military weapons set they're very nice to have for extras, for your vehicles. You can do whatever you want with them. Your model, you can paint them. You can leave them unpainted. They're just great to have. Right. Again, these, these two sprues are exactly the same as you can see. Exactly the same. So we're going to do one only. Okay, here we have is our car 98 case. And beautiful, look how beautifully molded that is. Karn, Karn AK scoped. I love the scope on that. It's right there. MG42. Uh, landmines. I don't know, I think these are metallic landmines. We have MP40s, one of my favorite German guns. Same with the Karn 98. We have anti-tank gun, which looks beautiful, actually. Flip around on the other side. We have our G... What oh, is this? Similar to a G43, right? It's an M41. Similar to a G43. We have MG42s. Stungewehr STG44 
let's put that around for you guys. Let's put the camera right here. You can see the SDG 44. These are just beautiful molded anti tank grenades. These are just beautifully molded. I love how to mirror molds their things. So yeah, beautiful kit made by Tamiya. And I think now it's time. Right after I put these away in the bag, it's gonna be time for our little announcement on new videos. It's my tradition of the channel. I okay guys. Let's talk. So soon enough I will have a review video of this Panzerkumfangen Astoff F which is incomplete as you can see. It's I still need to put this track on, but I can't because I need to buy super glue. So uh yeah, I will have a soon enough a reveal video. I'm still building it. I will have a reveal be video of unpainted and painted. And also, uh, I will upload, I'm not gonna upload, like, I'm not doing a tradition of uploading, like, in, at specific times. I'm gonna be uploading videos randomly, so you guys will get to watch my videos, but, like, random times. It could take two months, a week, it doesn't matter, it could just pop up any time. So, yeah, guys, uh, that's all you need to know, and, yes... If you guys are going to be requesting, I don't know if you requested this, but soon enough, I will be doing this kit, the uh, Humvee. I'll build this kit soon. So, uh, soon I'll have this kit built. I'll do a time-lapse build of this. And I want to do a miniatures painting video to show you how to paint miniatures of miniature weapons. Yeah, guys, that's about it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe and leave a like. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.